let's just take a moment and let's talk about hashtags. A lot of people have heard of them. Uh, some people use them all the time if you're on Twitter. Um, but I think a lot of educators and students need to be a little bit more aware of what a hashtag actually is. Um, I like this definition that I found on here. A hashtag is a way to aggregate tweets that are appended with a hashtag. Picture it like a magnet that will attract all messages categorized by that topical word or phrase. So basically it does the collecting for you as long as you've used the appropriate hashtag or you're searching for the appropriate hashtag. Um, do you need to have a Twitter account in order to look up hashtags? And the answer is no. Um, for teachers, I will share this article out on my Take Two for Tech, but I'm going to scroll down here because this mentions a lot of popular education hashtags. Now this article is several years old, not all of them are perfectly um, applicable anymore, but there are quite a few that are very good. Um, I use the hashtag iPad Ed quite a bit to look up new things or what's going on with iPads in education. So what I do is I just go to a new tab and I just type in hashtag and you can see I already have iPad Ed in there because um, I look it up often and I'm just going to do a search iPad Ed on Twitter and you'll notice that I'm not logged in right now so again you don't have to have the account but you can start to look and it says book creator team what is app smashing why app smash and there's an article here that if I wanted to look at more um, a resource for the classroom and supporting student independence and app choices so you're gonna find I can look at this a little bit further. I can go ahead, uh, be confident with your creative app choices. There is probably an article. Uh, so within moments, I can easily be doing research, finding new articles. Um, this is just a fantastic tool that I have found to be able to look up new resources quite quickly and easily. Um, is everything on here, now hashtags, Basically, anybody can create a hashtag. So if somebody else happens to use this for a different purpose, you will find some tweets in there that don't apply. But in general, people do pretty much follow the hashtags. Um, and I found it just an excellent tool to use and help me save time to find new ideas. So hopefully, you'll find this valuable as well. Get looking at those hashtags.